Hey all, welcome back to the channel. Cliff Jumper here, or Brendan as you might know me by. This is gonna be a real short review. A folk, couple of folks have asked about the color MFA display that I have in here, and I wanted to point this thing out because it is awesome, I love it. So I'm gonna walk you through it right now. So this is the aforementioned color MFA. I had this done by Matthew Litke. I apologize if I'm saying your name wrong, but just a quick overview of this thing because it's awesome. So this will be pretty quick. He let me do a, a custom startup screen with it, which is great. One of the nice things about this is it gives you so many features. So, you know, the typical stuff, your average speed, your travel time, distance traveled, how much fuel is remaining in your tank, distance to empty, that's something that you wouldn't get on the regular MFA. Uh, boost pressure, well, I'm not supercharged or turbo on here, so there's no boost pressure happening. Coolant temperature, that's nice digital display. Inlet air temperature, oil temperature and oil pressure are both things you can add to it as sensors. Um, battery voltage, Oh, this is kind of fun. Like it'll actually tell you how much power the motor is making depending on load. So that's a fun feature. Your current consumption, how many gallons per hour of fuel are you consuming? As well as how many miles per gallon. I'm averaging 18. I was just in a bunch of traffic, so that makes sense. And of course your speedometer. And it's just really good looking. Now I also had him swap out the needles for the Mark VI Golf needles. I thought they looked much better with the little silver rings matches the R32 rings. So if you are interested in getting one of these setups, go on Facebook. I'm gonna drop a link in the description to the group where you can get in. I'm not sure what his current status is, but I know there's a wait. You have to get on a wait list to get one of these send your cluster to him and he will do the modification. He's got a few options actually. I think you can buy one that's already done and then send yours back in as a core. I chose to send mine in and have him do it so I can keep it original and keep the immobilizer working and all that fun stuff. But anyway, Matthew is a genius with these things and highly recommend it. It's one of the best mods I have ever done to my Mark IV R32 is install this instrument cluster mod with the color display. So cliff jumper approved, go get one. And on that terrible disappointment, <laughs> it's time to say goodbye, we'll be back.